The J.B. Speed School of Engineering was founded in 1925 as a tribute to the late James Breckenridge Speed. We are known for uh, a number of distinctive characteristics, uh, including the fact that we offer a integrated five-year experience for our students uh, in which they can earn both a Bachelor of Science degree that's accredited by ABET and an ABET accredited Master of Engineering degree. The J.B. Speed School of Engineering has a rich history of supporting undergraduate education. It's one of a handful of schools that have mandatory co-op programs and we're unique in that we teach all of our own undergraduate mathematics for our students. Different programs for freshmen have evolved over the years, but in 2007 we created this Department of Engineering Fundamentals to improve our freshman retention and to focus on the scholarship of teaching and learning. Our programs are unique because we have focus towards getting our students academically capable um, and ready for the workplace. We have dedicated co-op advisors for our engineering students that help them find their co-op positions and they will have a full year of co-op experience when they graduate from speed school. We have many programs dedicated to the academic success and leadership of our freshman engineers. We have implemented a new process, a new uh, curriculum, if you will, for our first year students involving what we call the engineering garage. It's a maker space that we have here on campus and all of our freshmen uh, will be in that. They'll be building actual devices. We're going to get away from showing them the formula of a screwdriver and actually handing them a screwdriver and having them build something. We're very excited about our Center for Teaching and Learning Engineering, which is a partnership with our Delphi Center, the university's Center for Teaching and Learning. We are focused on developing evidence-based strategies in all of our courses and sharing it not only with those faculty in our department, but those in the rest of the school. We have worked as a department and fundamentally changed every course we teach. We now use a lot of videos to deliver presentations and demonstrations difficult to do in class and to free up time for students to do more active things in class. The reality is that many faculty and many individuals don't understand team skills or haven't had the opportunity to understand how to break them down, how to teach them, how to help students engage effectively with one another in team environments. And so we wanted to provide an opportunity for our faculty across the Speed School to learn and think about strategies they can use in their teaching to be more effective, helping their students collaborate with one another. In the faculty learning community on collaborative learning, I get to experience and more deeply the collaborative learning approach. I learned about why that's beneficial for students. We talked about um, how people learn, which is some work that's done that's explained that one of the factors that affects teaching is the sense of community that students have. So that really led me to make collaborative learning a part of my classes because I knew it could be beneficial to students and it changed how I teach forever. <laughs>